first of all, it was a movie set. Finally, you're so used to being on a television set and all of a sudden it's this big glossy film. So mm -hmm. how did that feel? Not much different, mm, honestly. No, not at all. I think it's fair to say that, the, you know, the television show always felt so cinematic. That's true. You know, it really did. So when we got to the film, it just felt like, oh, this is this felt like we always did. We just have more time and resources, more resources. More resources. Yeah. But it really felt like, you know, we had a lot of the same crew. The fact that almost all of the same almost crew, all really, of yeah. it. Yeah. Our wardrobe, our yeah. hair, our makeup, our DP, you know, our camera that Doug was directing it. So it actually the irony is that it didn't feel like, oh, this is what the movie felt like. It just was like, oh, this is what the show always felt like. Mm. And, and it was crazy that it was just a television show. We, we would have, uh, for whenever this, we, the series, the seasons would premiere, we always had our premieres in New York mm -hmm. at these big theaters. So we would, we would watch the episodes on these big screens. Mm -hmm. And, and it, it felt like, wow, this could be a movie. It felt mm -hmm. cinematic. It didn't feel out of place. On, on a big screen, so I think that might have even been where the kind of the first seed of the idea was kind of spawned. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, absolutely. I, I just spoke to Doug and he feels like a sponge uh, to people who always want to tell him about stories in Hollywood that they want to inject in the film. <laughs> uh, is it the same with you guys? Do you, you know, keep attentive to what's going on around you and then kind of influence something? I feel like people pitch over the years where people were quick to pitch stories. Mm. You know, they know they they knew that ultimately Doug was the boss, but it would be like, hey, I got something, blah blah mm -hmm. blah, blah, and you, you pass it on to Doug or not, depending on what the was <laughs> right. idea. Yeah, well, Sloan does represent a lot of women in Hollywood, doesn't she? I I I wish that she <laughs> did too. in a lot of ways. I mean, I think that the thing is, is that she depicts that sort of grounded, even keel woman who isn't influenced by all the craziness. She just sort of breezes through it all, you know? She kind of, to me, I see Sloane, she's sort of like Hollywood royalty. Her, you know, mm. her father is this giant mogul. She's been around it her whole life, and yet somehow she doesn't define herself from it at all. Like, which is very interesting, especially in a town like L.A. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I mean, that really was like an early story point, but it, at the end of the day, really, we really kind of went away from that. Yeah. We never really... Yeah, it was sort of one of the, like, little facts that we knew about her, but, right. yeah, it wasn't what yeah, she was about. Yeah, it was never what she was about at all. Mm -hmm. I was so excited when you guys turned up at the Golden Globes because I was there and I didn't expect you to be there, and all of a sudden ah, the entourage got well. <laughs> is, it, is it the same with you guys? Do you, you know, get a kick out of those, like, fake real situations? Yes. Yeah, it's, it, it's always fun, especially since uh, people don't, I think, with this particular, the, the Golden Globe, I don't think really people understood what, <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> because because we've been to the Golden Globes as ourselves. Exactly. So uh, I, and and plus people knew we did the movie. So I think as we were walking down the red carpet at the Golden Globes, the photographers are I, I, you could see this look on their face, and they're like, "What is that? Do I? Don't I?" Well, they're yeah. like, "Is this them walking the car carpet as themselves? Are they shooting?" Yeah, they didn't know and then they say. collectively kind of all rolled their eyes and just started taking pictures. <laughs> yeah. It really was. It was. It was really. Interesting, because they were like, well, Very either way, meta. let's just yeah. take pictures and yeah. we'll be in the movie or, or, or not or, or not. whatever. But it, it's just funny. They just kind of, no one told them anything. They just kind of <laughs> picked right up on it and just started taking pictures. It was so it was hilarious. Cool. Yeah. And also, too, I think it was, you know, certainly it was one of these moments where you're like, there is no other television show that could pull that off. Yeah. Like, on the day, show up. Be wrapped literally minutes before the real celebrities yeah. of the show are coming on, and you kind of look back and you're like, "Yeah, yeah we got wrapped before on. the show started. <laughs> we walked out. We were in our car driving home in our, in our tuxedos. Um, oh, you didn't stay? No, we didn't no. stay. We were invited. Um, you know, yeah, there's no room for us. You know, the, the funny thing too is like a lot of these stunts that we've pulled over the years. Yeah, like it's already of... happening. Like before, as they're picking up on it. We're already three quarters of the way done. Yeah. So by the time anybody even realizes what we're up to, they're like, "Oh, okay, they're shooting." And then by the time anybody actually realizes, by the time people are fully aware, we're done. We're out the door. Right. We're in the car. We're on the way home. And they're like, "Shit, how did we miss that? <laughs> yeah. How did we miss that?" Magic. <laughs> I'm already rallying for Entourage Two. So how do you guys feel about it? Not me rallying, but 
making a second one. Yeah. I feel good about you rallying. Thank I you. I feel good yeah. about you rallying. Uh, listen, let, let's see how this one does and, and, and take a step back and, and look at it and see if it's worth another go. Mm-hmm. It's just too early to tell. I think for Sloane's dresses, at least, it's worth another <laughs> Yes, exactly. <laughs> She's got her figure back. We want to see her get that, that figure back after the movie. Hey, she had it already at the Golden Globes. She's a oh, quick one, right. Sloane. Oh, that's very nice. Thank you.